Watching the world burn, watching the world burn. November 5th, 2024. Let's get into it. I'm wondering, I'm wondering if civil war is going to be the outcome of this election. And we'll get into that theme hopefully in a video later today. And I, But I had to make an emergency video. Um, and, and this is why I tell everybody to get the hell off of YouTube. I uh, put up an a election day video uh, as an advertisement for Trump. And uh, YouTube took it down, man. They wiped it out. Now, to YouTube's credit, they just said it was copyright violation, which is incredibly stupid. Uh, and they said it was the Tucker Carlson Network that uh, put the uh, copyright violation on my video, even though it was just an advertisement for Trump uh, with uh, Robert Kennedy Jr., which uh, I find that suspicious. Now, the video is still up on The Burn on Rumble. It's still up on That CyberSec Guy on Odyssey. And it's still up on X at That CyberSec Guy. So you can watch the video. And I wasn't going to make a video tonight. I, I just... I, I literally just watched the movie. I was chilling out. I'm like you, man. I just kind of want to pop the popcorn and watch the election uh, and, and chill out. But when they took down that video, uh, I'm sorry, it, 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 really, it really made me mad. And uh, so let's just get into some election news because that's the most important thing right now. The Georgia Supreme Court just ruled that ballots cannot be accepted and counted after the deadline by election officials anywhere in the state. Democrats in Cobb County wanted to accept 3,000 mail-in ballots after Election Day deadline, but the court just shot down their plans. This is beautiful. Well, you know, this is what I'm telling you. Democrats are trying to cheat every way they freaking can. I mean, it's, it's so in your face. I mean, who, who would want to accept ballots after the, after the election is over? Let's just keep going. Breaking Assistant County Manager Zach Scaria has confirmed the full election results might take a few days to announce after Election Day in Mar Maricopa County, Arizona. That is the most corrupt place on the planet as far as election goes. Why would it take a few days to count the ballots? It's so in your face. The Democrats are trying to cheat, man. They want to keep Kerry Lake out of office, and, they, and of course they want to defeat Donald Trump. But I mean, Florida, we're going to be done election night. Okay, we've got a hell of a lot more people in Florida than they have in Maricopa County, Arizona, and our election results will be done. So you, you tell me. He says the candidates, uh, the candidates ahead might change after election night, after days of counting, and that it's normal. <laughs> now, I wanted to throw up a couple of videos like I always do, but I can't risk a copyright violation on this video. Uh, or I can't risk giving YouTube an excuse to take it down. This is strictly mostly a YouTube video, although I'll post it on X and I'll post it on Rumble. But I, I hope you see what the, what the game that YouTube is playing. I mean, they've knocked, what, 6, 17 people off of uh, YouTube? Uh, they, they, they've taken down my election video? This is why uh, you need to get yourself onto other platforms. Odyssey, uh, Rumble, uh, Rockfin. Uh, I'm not on Rockfin, but someday I want to go there. James O'Keefe, Philadelphia City Commissioner's Office tells non-citizens they can vote if they are Philly residents. NGO Sabia across the street sends non-citizen voter with ITIN. Now, I can't put up that video. Now, I will probably make a video about all this maybe later on, but... Right now, I'm just trying to give you all the, the, the shenanigans that the Democrats are trying to pull. Do you see how there's no Republicans in this fight? Republicans, all we want is fair and uh, elections. Same-day voting, uh, paper ballots, uh, but it's the Democrats that, you know, that are trying to cheat. And I hope you're seeing that, right? Uh, you have any Democrat friends? Why don't you ask them? Why wouldn't you want paper ballots and same-day voting? Or and a holiday, and if even if it isn't same day voting, let's say one week before mail in ballots, that uh, you know, uh, and and by the way, there are a lot of lot of uh, stories coming out about how the um, military personnel are not getting the ballots at this point. So the Pentagon is pulling a a, a, a Democrat. You know, I told you that all the the Pentagon generals and stuff are, are Democrats. Ah. Uh, 
Yeah, this is different. Let's, let's see. She was always voted by mail in Nevada as a Democrat and never had a single problem. This year, she mailed in her ballot, but voted Republican for the first time ever. Her ballot was rejected. If you have already voted, please check to make sure your ballot was accepted. And if it wasn't, reach out to your local RNC chapter to find out what you need to do in order to cure it. So I just want to make a brief video. This is all the shenanigans the Democrats are pulling. No, there are no stories about Republicans trying to cheat in the election. It's all Democrats. Peace out. Stay free.